Hello, welcome back to some unboxing. This is what we're unboxing today. I'm actually really excited because I already unboxed one and it was awesome. It was freaking amazing, honestly. And I'm excited to unbox this one. I was gonna unbox both, but I could not wait because my friend already unboxed his, so. Yeah, so it comes with the Raichu GX card and a cool little background thing. Um, and obviously one of these again. So this is what he looks like. He looks dope, honestly. Um, so there's that. And it comes with, I think, four, looks like. Cards or packs. I could. And this is what held them. Looks like binoculars. No, I'm just <laughs> but, um. There's that. Ooh, some cool dark Charizard, or I don't know what kind of Charizard this is, but it looks dopers. And then Mewtwo. And Mew. So I'm gonna probably start with Mewtwo, just cause. He's awesome. <laughs> so here's what that one looks like. And it's a green, like, bellied Mewtwo. Green and yellow, and green belly and tail. Mm. So my friend taught me a secret. You're supposed to take this card off. You're supposed to do one, two, three. Top three, put them at the bottom. And then... So we got Kogo's Trap, it's a supporter card. Fluid focus, there we go. An opponent's active Pokemon is now confused and poisoned. Wow, damn. Lieutenant Surge's Strategy supporter card. You can play this card only if you have more prize cards remaining than your opponent. During this turn, you can play three supporter cards, including this card. Oh, including, so it has, so you can only play two more after that. That's still good. Um, uh, Magmar. Dope. Uh, Staryu. Nice. Ekans. Ooh, he has an Articuno in the background, look at that. That's so cool. Caterpie. Perez. Charmander, uh, Voltorb, it's a cool little shiny one too, uh, Butterfree, ooh I needed this last one, and some fairy energy which I really need, I actually, I'm going to show you something after but I'm actually going to start making some, some decks. Okay, uh, put that right there. So, got another one of those, obviously. It's kind of obvious now that we're going to get that with every pack, which is kind of nice, actually, not going to lie. kind of like it. So, we were, did I show you the Charizard deck? Well, here's the old pack. There's the other one, but yeah. Um, one, two, three, put those at the beginning. Brock's Grit. Shuffle six in any combination of Pokemon and basic energy cards into your dis from your discard pile into your deck. That's actually dope. If it would there we go. Um far fetched. Nice. Graveler. Nice. Geo dude. Nice. Mm. Cubone. Eevee. Psyduck. 
Ooh, and this Ekans has a rainbow in the background, so maybe ho. No, she can't. But, yeah. He looks cute. <laughs> Caterpie. Snorlax. And another fairy energy, which is good. I don't have that many fairy energies, so this is helping. And I gave two to my friend, which I kind of regret, but it's fine. It's only two, even though I had like four, I bet. <laughs> but I'm getting more, so it's all good. Okay, so no like really special cards yet. Hopefully we find some. Another one of those. One, two, three. Another Graveler. Farfetched. Jinx. Another Ekans. Perez. Charmander. Slowpoke. Psyduck. Eevee. Ooh, a Lapras. Nice. It's a really good one. I like Lapras. And then a Fighting Energy. And last but not least, the Mew one. Hopefully something's good in there. Another one of these, obviously. One, two, three. Misty Cerulean City Gym. The attacks of Starmie GX, both yours and your opponents, do 40 more damage to the opponent's active Pokemon before applying resistance and weakness and resistance. That's awesome because I actually just got that in my other tin. I got freaking like two or three in my other tin. Tin, which was dope. I guess it kind of makes sense that I'm not getting that much in this one. I only got one so far. Discard up to two of your bench Pokemon that have no damage counters on them, all cards attached to them. And all cards attached to them. So that's kind of good if you have like a. If you have not enough room on your bench and you want to. Get rid of some Pokemon you don't need. Ooh, a Fairy Jigglypuff, which is good for my Fairy deck. Caterpie. Yep. I dropped it, of course. Perez. Ooh, I saw something shiny. When I accidentally separated it. Psyduck. Charmander. Charmillion. Which is do Ooh. I see what it is. It's a Moltres and Zapdos and Articuno GX tag team. 300 health. Trinity Burn is fire, water, electric, normal for 210. And Sky Legends GX. Shuffle this Pokemon and all cards attached to it into your deck. If this Pokemon has at least one extra, so that means, well, is it just extra after the Trinity Beam? Or is it just a fire, water, and electric energy attached to it in addition to its attack cost. So it would be pretty much like using the Trinity Burn. So you'd have to have the fire, water, electric, and then a normal. So it would just be that. 
plus the normal, so it would be pretty much the same exact as doing the Trinity Burn. Um, if you have all those attached to it, this attack does 111 damage to three of your opponent's Pokemon. Don't apply weakness or resistance. So this, so that Pokemon and two others. That's crazy. Ooh, look how sexy that is though. This is what my friend got. I was so jealous, but he's gonna be upset that I got it too. <laughs> and then I got a dark energy, which is nice. So, what I was gonna show you is I actually bought some decks. Well, some deck boxes, anyways. This, well, they were for, um, they were supposed to be for magic. But I don't play magic, and this is like perfect because my deck is actually psychic. I don't know if you want to see it or not. I don't know. I'll just show it next time. But yeah, my deck mostly has psychic in it, so there's that. And then I also got. A, it was like a six pack, which is dope, and it was only 20 bucks, so why not? I got a. Orange one for fire, pink one for fairy, electric one, well, yellow for electric, a green for grass, and a blue for water, which is dope. I'm kind of excited to make the fairy deck most because it's going to be really hard to get that much energies to make a fairy deck. Because I usually do like 20 energies, so it's going to cost a lot of energies. The most energies I have in my deck, I found out, is fire. I have the most fire in my deck. My deck is literally fire. No, I'm just kidding. Um, well, it's not a deck. It's pretty much just the accumulation of all my cards. But my friend's gonna be so upset that I got that. <laughs> I, I'm I'm so happy I got that though. That's crazy. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um that's it for now. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace out.